And this is where DOST's Balik Scientist Program comes in. It was put into place to encourage Filipino experts abroad with advanced degrees in science technology to return to the country and serve the country. It was on October 24, 1975 that the Presidential Decree 819 under Ferdinand Marcos Sr. first established the Balik Scientist Program. Naisabatas naman ito noong June 15, 2018 sa ilalim ng RA 11035, also known as the Balik Scientist Act. Sa ilalim ng batas, layo ng programa na mas maparami ang scientists at researchers sa bansa, mapalakas ang ating academic institutions as well as enterprises, at mapabilis ang knowledge sharing pati na ang pagpasok ng mga bagong teknolohiya sa Pilipinas. Kung maraming umaalis, mayroon din namang bumabalik. The important thing was not the financial obligations but my moral obligations. Yung nag-encourage sa akin na umuwi is to really mentor yung next generation. I was able to render community service. The research and development ecosystem that Philippines is much more developed now compared to about a decade ago. The Balik Scientist Program is a huge opportunity for you to give back. We have so much to do here in the country. If Balik Scientists are any indicators of where Filipino scientists are in the world, the data would show that they are in most continents, including the North America, Europe, Africa, Australia, and all of Asia. As of 2022, a total number of 592 Balik scientists were encouraged to return to the Philippines with 759 engagements helping 131 host institutions across 16 regions. Tinutulungan nila ang ating akademya, mga ahensya ng gobyerno, at iba't ibang industriya kasama ang agriculture, health, and energy sectors. Bukod sa pamasahe pa uwi ng Pilipinas, may iba't iba pang incentives para sa mga successful applicants ng Balik Scientist Program. Isa sa mga tumugon sa panawagan na ito sa mga scientists, lalo na nitong panahon ng pandemya, ay si Dr. Vic Ilag. During COVID, isang creative na solution na ginawa nila yung virtual, actual, actually ako virtual, Balik Scientist. So even though pabalik-balik ako na for the past 30 years, First time ko lang maging official Balik Scientist under the Balik Scientist program. We adapted to times as well when COVID struck, walang makapuntang Balik Scientist dito. So we revised our guidelines. They can now have either medium term or long term. 100% during the COVID period of our short term was done virtually. But for other scientists who can come to the Philippines, we encourage a physical engagement with them. They can be balik-balik scientists. Ang tanong, nakakatulong nga ba ito sa science at technology sa bansa? I think it's helpful in a way na it creates incentives para makabalik permanently as well as even short term. Most, if not all, na Pinoy overseas are more than willing to help and contribute. Ang kailangan lang ng Philippines maging creative kung paano facilitate. As a starting point, I'm glad it's there, but we should also be doing more to prevent scientists from leaving in the first place and once they come back, prevent them from leaving again. <laughs>